Right, these are the bits we need to put onto the bivvy before we can actually attach this. So what I do know, these is what's going to hold the social cap on the skull cap slash social cap it needs to thread through these to tighten it to the bivvy so we've got four of them it's like spare tightening screws oh we've got three of these why have we got three So all right, we've got five. So I think, have we got five? Yeah, so I'm gonna put one on the outer edges. So one on this one, one on this one, and one in the middle. So obviously like these two here that I'm touching won't have anything on. But it does say, um, do not attempt to try and put these clips on when the bivvy is erect. So. Right. It doesn't actually say. I mean, I've got three. It doesn't say which ones to put them on to. But like I say, I'm going to do the outer edges and then the one in the middle. So what you need to do. Pull it apart a little bit so you've got the elastic showing. Slide elastic through the center gap then just slightly slide it up now they're saying it should be about 10 mil from the bottom of this bit but god knows what that is but about measuring it then we got the little clips to put over it once it's all tightened so let's go and tighten these ones down first. So you've got the hex side up. That's what the nut will go into. It's quite a large gap at the moment, isn't it? So hopefully it all tightens up all right. <coughs> so obviously you're gonna make sure that the strap bit is on the outside. Oh, let's try and get that actually in shot. I was just trying to lift it up so I could actually see. So what I've done, turned it over, just watched the nut because it did fall out. Hopefully you can all see that all right, it's obviously quite difficult. What you're trying to do is sort of cack handed. Right, I would line it up with like the fabric here. I mean, we can always adjust it accordingly later. You're obviously gonna want these quite tight because you don't obviously want them um, coming loose. There we go, there's one. There we go, right, that gap's closed up really nicely now. I don't want to tighten it sort of too much and obviously start threading it or anything. That's obviously the, the sort of the screw side. So that is the side with the knot. I'm not going to put them on just yet, but obviously 
got the little black bits to um, put over the ends to make it tidy and that. So, right, let's do the rest. So, right, one, two, next one. You're gonna pull it apart a little bit. Slide the elastic through the gap. You just need to spread the block a little bit. There we go, so that's on. And then we're gonna put that in place. Again, you just have to ease the block open a little bit. Right, about, it says about 10 mil. I mean, I'll just try and roughly get it the same. I mean, once the bivvy's actually up, you can probably adjust them slightly then. I mean, I don't think they need to be dead perfect. It's right, like, let's get the bivvy up. Right, the bivvy is up. So, I do need to just... I need to turn that one that way a little bit. That one hasn't got one. That one needs just turning a little bit. Hasn't got one. I think that is the only one that's actually probably right. <laughs> right, uh, got the Allen key in my pocket. So let's, let's just go and adjust those now. There we go, all tightened up and lined up now, so it looks a little bit better. Again, I don't think it actually has to be that precise. Um, but, there we go, they're all lined up. So we do have a problem, and I wish it would tell you this in the manual. Oh, for Christ's sake, it's all falling bloody down now. Oh, anyway, these, don't put them on these ones and then the middle one at the back like I've done. This one needs to go on this one. And then you've got that one. And then you've got that one it needs to go on. So I've got to take off this one. So, easiest way to put it. Not the, not the front corners, but the three at the back so I've got one so god didn't say that in the manual so anyway right don't know about you but I'd be fuming if I put one of these on upside down <laughs> they're really easy to put in just line them up with the holes I'm not actually sure, to be fair, how you'd actually get the buggers off. I suppose, in hindsight, you wouldn't really need to. Because... That's the nut side. This is the screw side. You've got a little bit of a notch out, so I suppose you put the Allen key in there, I suppose, and just pop it off. But, anyway. That's that done. <laughs> 